Antique lovers and toy collectors converged on the exhibition last weekend for the antique and toy sale. There were many exhibitors selling their wares from old farm trucks to comics to whimsical china. Dick Gruenheide, organizer of the toy show, has been involved for the last five years and running the event for the last two. He says there's a lot of interest in antiques in southern Alberta. Well, most of the people are here are older and we all still like toys. <laughs> so the, the love of toys has just never left us. And most of the people here actually buy and trade and sell. Doll collectors were in luck as some other vendors included Conjo Handmade Dolls by Jennifer Giesbrecht and rare Barbies like Marilyn Monroe. Gruenheide says planning these events are always a lot of fun. I like meeting all the people, and especially when you see a young kid come in, hey mom, can I have that? <laughs> so that's really good to see. The event is put on by the Coaldale Toy Collectors Club, and one of the local vendors, Kathy Danielson, has been involved for about eight years. That's when I started collecting antiques when we were first married 35 years ago, and uh, of course, it sort of takes over, so it comes a point where you need to thin things out. And uh, so we just started doing these shows, just, uh, you know, selling some stuff that we aren't emotionally attached to. Um, and uh, it's just great fun. You meet such interesting people. One of the older items for sale was an old baseball toy from 1886, priced at $3,200. Danielson says while there's lots of unique items, the door fee also goes to a good cause. It varies every year, so after they, after they count the money up, um, the, the collector's club decides which charity they're going to do, donate it to, and then they'll send us a letter saying which charity it went to. So. The antique show and toy sale has been a big success. You never know what or who you're going to find. For the Endeavour Online, I'm Melissa Villeneuve.